Okay. Hey right. guys, what's up? Zach and obviously you can probably tell by the screen right here. It's the game Wizard 101. Yeah, I thought I wanted to show you guys on here since I just recently downloaded this again. And you can see I have my three characters I just decided to do. Yeah. But today we're going to make... Actually, no. We're just going to roll with my Pyromancer, which I haven't used yet. So, let's just get this game going. <clears throat> And yes, I'm not going to leave anything cut out of this because I, well, I'm just starting this newly and I just want to see what this could get me on my channel because I haven't really done this in a while. So I'm not going to talk through these cutscenes. I'm just doing this one because, well, I'm just explaining it to you guys for right now, but if you want more videos about this, just leave a comment and if we get 20 or so likes or probably even more than that I will make another video doing more of this and if you want a new character I can definitely make one so just ask and you'll receive all right I'm gonna stop talking and let this go Yeah, I'm just letting you guys know, I am possibly not going to accept any friend requests that you add me on here, and I know some of you might not like me on here and just screw with me. I don't know if I can use that word. We're just going to roll with it. But yeah, I just don't want you guys to screw with me on here and just be mean to me and to other people. So... Just play this game for fun, or you can get your friends or whatever and just play it together. It's really not a bad game. I grew up playing this game when I was still, like, probably going into middle school. So, yeah. It's a good game. And just saying, these lost souls right here are very weak. So just any attack will just get them. But they give you low XP and other stuff. And if you want to know what your current XP is that you get from them or whatnot, hit your enter key on your keyboard if you're playing on laptop. You can see a chat box. I move mine over here because it's more easier for me to just look at stuff on the side. Rather than having it up here where your friend requests and you're looking for people on. So, if you guys want to check out this game for yourself, just do it. I know I'm repeating a bunch of more stuff, but it's just a fun game to me to play. And honestly, I just loved playing it when I was a kid. So, I don't know if I'm supposed to be talking more often, like other YouTubers do. Yeah, sorry, I skipped that. It's kind of too long, and I don't want to get into combat again. Okay, if you guys don't really know, this is your health, and this is your mana where you can cast spells. If this runs out, you will possibly, I think, you automatically flee from a battle. I've never had that happen before. And if you get this, 
which is your health all the way down. I think you exit the battle, plus also spend coins to like bring you back. I'm not too sure about this game so far. I haven't had that experience before. I might have in the past, but not on here. Yeah, that's a crappy way of explaining it, but here we are. Oh. Yeah, I'll explain a much more that later on, or you, you just want to explore on yourself in the beginning where the tutorial is. But I'm worried we won't be able to drive the phantoms away for good without knowing why they're attacking us. We've got to find out what's behind this. Another intrepid student, Siri Nightshan, also came to help. Maybe he's learned something useful. And yeah, if you guys are asking what I'm recording on too, it's, I'm just recording this on my phone because I don't have good equipment yet. Oh, hey there, I'm Saren. You're new here, aren't you? Well, I for one am very glad you're here. I couldn't help but notice how you took down those lost souls. I have Actually, to say, I would rather put your chat box a bit more up when I heard there was... because you won't be able to hit your thing. Hang on. This is God, your other helper right here. Congratulations! You have just earned your first badge. Each badge will give you a title that you can proudly display below your name. If you have multiple badges achieved, then you can choose which one. Not every title is as easy to gain as the one you have gotten. Good luck in the tougher challenges. Okay, I'm going to try and figure out the badge thing I just realized. So, be right back. Okay, I figured out something. When you go into your character up here, you go to the badges right there. I'm very stupid for that. Alright. So let's continue this quest. And you can just pick up multiple ones. It won't really affect anything. You can pause to read all this. I already know all this. I really don't know what to talk about anymore. I'm just doing my own thing in here. Oh, and these wooden chests, you can get extra gold. They're scattered mostly somewhere. Sometimes they're on the maps. Here we can show you. Around this area, there's one in the back. On this area, when you walk into the Unicorn Park. Right there. Sometimes there's one that spawns like right between here Or is it no, it's probably over here There's one right there before you enter into the hedge maze and there's one in the hedge maze You just gotta look for with the um, icon above it This is wooden chest and you'll know And I don't know I might stream this maybe I don't know I gotta wait and see what I can do for this Yeah, I'm transparent right now. That means I won't be able to fight. Now I'm not. I can go fight. And uh, these cards, if you use, don't worry. You'll get them back either way. I forgot that the dialogue also overlaps here too. I might make this video up to like 10 minutes or above it if I don't pay attention. Because this game can get you lost in some ways because it's so fun to play most of the time. And yes, you can have players join you and whatnot and you can do whatever you want for this 
I'm just going around trying to look for stuff and get what I need. Oh, and you can find these, or you can purchase them in some stores, but these are reagents you can use. And you're going to have to click every single bubble that ends up right here, and some of them right here. You've just collected a reagent. Reagent reagents go in your reagent bag, which you can access by selecting the crafting tab in your file, or by pressing J on your keyboard. Oh, and these gold wisps. You get them, you get more extra gold. Why am... Um, is it not... Okay, never mind. Well, I can't. Yeah, it was a good try, though. Yeah. So yeah, once you do the skeletal quest, you can also give it to Olivia Don Willow and Serene Night Chan. But for her, you can get a ring. Oh, bless you, child. To put on new equipment, mousing over it. Thanks again, young wizard. Maybe I can find and yes, helpful young wizard. There's equipment that that define oh, what your um guy um school is. For starters, you can go to all equipment, but I would rather like go to like these to make them more better. So yeah, I'll get more health if I equip it. But if you wanted to get that extra health, I would rather go get a red orb, which is a health orb. The blue orbs for your mana to replenish it. I don't know if I said that already, but the more you know. Yes, yeah, so I just put on everything, which also adds up to your like equipment of what you can resist more. For example, this hat I got is to resist two two percent of the fire school, where it doesn't affect you more from fire spells. Now we're just going to hedge maze. I forgot. Can I also? Oh yeah, I forgot you can do that. I just basically screwed myself for right there, but... Yeah, this is where mostly everyone hangs out. You can get the chat going. I think this is where people like... Roleplay and whatnot. As you can see, they're roleplaying. I don't really do that. Because I have no one to do that with and I'm not really interested in that for right now. You can do it on your own if you want. But that's up to you. Uh, hang on, let me check something real quick. Be right back. Okay, I'm back, sorry. I just had to check something real quick. Oh, I can't get rid of that. Alright, we're just gonna stick with that. I don't know why people RP in here, it's just what they do. It's, I mean, it's their fun. I'm not gonna ruin it for them. They can do whatever they want. I'm just here to play the game, because I really missed it. And yes, you can also hear other battles from other people. I don't know if I clarified that before or you heard it before. So just letting you guys know. Oh yeah, there's a chest right here too. I forgot about this. Even though I just played it today, I'm losing my mind to kind of a, kind of trying to remember everything where everything is and how it goes. 
I believe there was a chest over here. No, there isn't. All right. You can mostly find one right there, a chest, if you want it. The evil forces that loosed the undead upon Unic's vile bone king. Dispelled? It pains me to say it. Once you've dispelled the bone cages and collected the fairy dust, return to me immediately. Good luck, young wizard. May the light guide you. Yeah, these quests are not really far-fetched. You can just do them whenever you want. Because they're all around the area. If you're just one person in your group, you can only go into battle with one. Or if you're going to a boss battle, it'll have two or more with them. Or just like a quest line in the tower. Yeah, you'll find a gold wisp in the middle because there's both of us. Oh, the same person joined me. Well, this is going to be interesting. I'm gonna let this person take the gold wisp this time, just in case, because I don't want to be selfish. Well, I'll help this person. It gives a bonus. Never mind, I guess they left. Yeah. I wouldn't just fight anyways. Alright, well, yeah, people can leave in these sort of situations. I just don't know why they always leave. After I go back to do Serene Night Chant, I'm gonna wrap this up. Because I'm hitting the 20 minute mark. And yes, this is all raw, uncut footage. I'm just gonna put my intro and outro. It's gonna be weird sounding, I know. It's my new stuff, but. You hear a tiny, joyful it's just my way of doing stuff. Reputation as it now we must root out who is behind. Is that? But how? 
the fairy rattle bones. Or actually, I'm going to end it off you where I'm going to do a boss. Quickly, you must ride Siren at once. Ask him if he knows of a tower ringed in bones. Go. And yeah, these stuff you can only get for one day, which is... It's stupid, yes, I know, but... It gets you everywhere faster. But yeah, I'm going to end this off on the boss fight that's coming up. It's really not much of a boss. He gives you more XP, but the most main missions or whatever you do earn you more, as you can see. I received 120. If you can't see, then there. But yeah. I don't know if I mentioned that either. I'm confused on some stuff if I don't remember. This is my first time recording in a long time. And I'm just getting the hang of stuff again. This mission, so I can have it for later. I know where he is, so if you just want to go to him, obviously he's right over here where I mentioned. Oh, I have a quest right here. I got a new boss to do. She's Black Lady Black Hope is also another boss in this game. Which I don't know where I can find her. Oh yeah, right there. I think I've done her before. I just don't remember. It's been a while since I played this game. We already mentioned that a bunch. I'm sorry for boring you guys right now. I'm just Remembering a bunch of stuff from the old days when I used to play this game. But let's see. Is the one chest back here? No, it is not. But yeah, these bosses you can do multiple times with, but you gotta watch your health and mana if you want to try and defeat them. Rattlebones is an interesting character, to say the least. I usually attack him first because he does more stuff than the Dark Fairy. And that shield is a pain in the... You know what I'm saying. Since it's YouTube gui guidelines, I can't curse or anything like that. That's the way it is. So, yeah, we're just stuck like this. And just with one more hit. Hmm. Imp or Dark Sprite? I'm gonna go with the Dark Sprite. Ah! You saw that? That's when... That's when if you're an enemy or yourself and your magic 
does that, that means you can't cast anything until your next turn. Oh yeah, if you're a um, death school person, these would actually help you. If you're battling rattle bones right here, he's actually a pretty good source for getting equipment, like I did in my previous character. He's way much more better than anything I've experienced. So yeah, with that, I'm going to complete this quest. And I guess I'll do the next boss in the next video. <clears throat> Dang, it feels weird doing all this again, but you it, hopefully you? you'll you enjoy all this. The darkness plaguing unicorn with rattlebones defeated. The god should. Ooh, that tone looks important. You should take it to the library in the commons. Harold Argleston will know what to do with it. I really don't know the difference between these boots I got. Oh, I get it. Does more damage. I mean, you can pick either one. I'm picking a little bit more fire because there's a lot of fire enemies that use fire spells. But anyway, anyways, guys. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next video if you if I get more than what I said in the beginning. But hope you enjoyed and goodbye.